We've had a great morning here at Emirates Golf Club. Um, we've been fitting the new 915 um, fairway woods for customers this morning. Um, I've got Brendan here with me who's had great success fitting guys into the new fairway wood range. Uh, 915 fairway woods have been extremely uh, successful for us. Um, and, and, and even on tour, we've, we've seen you know Jordan Spieth recently. He saw that great three wood he hit into the last hole at uh, Chambers Bay to win the US Open. Uh, so Brendan, just uh, talk me through the, th uh, the fairway wood range. Um, well, how is it differing from 913? Okay, cool. Well, I'm going to start off with the, the F head. The F head is a 175cc head. What we've noticed with this compared to the 913 is it actually launches a little bit higher and on average the spin is down to 200 RPMs. It can get up to 750 RPMs on a well struck shot. Um, the distance and carry with it, again on average is three yards uh, better and can get up to 11 yards. Um, what we've noticed with the FD, it's a slightly smaller head. Um, got really great feedback from some of the tour players with this club. Uh, it launches a little bit lower, less spin again and it's similar, it's, it's got about three yards extra from the 913 on average carry and um, up to again to 11 to 15 yards with this one um, in, in yards and, in some cases. And Brendan, how has that changed um, from 913? Obviously the 913 FD was a bigger and larger head, now it's, it's changed around, yeah? Yeah, well the feedback from some of the tour guys was that the head was a little bit too big and they wanted to have a club that they could move a little bit more in the air. So the feedback was just a little bit of a smaller head. Um, what's really, really worked really impressively is the active recoil channel in this. It, it's phenomenal. It just, it's so fast off the face. It's up to 2 miles per hour to 2.4 miles per hour faster off the face. It's really good. Has that seen, I mean, for, for a, a, an amateur golfer, that's a massive gain really for, for a furrow. It's a great weapon to have in the, in the bag to be able to hit. I thought we went a long way. Massively, and, and another thing that Tiger's really focused in on, and, and they started with the 910, was the, uh, the short fit hosel. So you've got 16 different settings you can have. So if you're going to a faster running course, you know, you could set it down and maybe use it off a few tee boxes. Or if you're going to maybe park land where you want to carry a few things, you can set up the, up the lofts. You can change also for a draw or a bit of a bit of a fade if you like as well. And, really and how's the, the shaft range work for you as a fitter? Is it has it really helped you get guys into the optimum sort of launch and spin? Yeah, the shaft range is very impressive. Um, we've got the Aldi the Rogue Silver and Black, which you can see on tour is, is being used by nearly most of the top professionals. Um, and then you've got right down to the, the 70, uh, 70 uh, Diamana whiteboard, which is a little bit heavier for the faster swing speeds. And then we've right down to the red, which is for the slower kind of swing speeds for the amateurs, yeah. the older guys, yeah. the guys who don't swing it that fast. Just gets to launch up in the air and they've, they've had really good success with it. Cool. So it, the active recall channel, um, obviously the, the technology being on the sole, um, I find personally, I think this really works even better off the turf. Because um, obviously with the active recall channel being on the sole of the club, you know, it really activates that when we're, we're hitting off turf. Yeah, we, yeah, we've had great feedback from T and from Turf that it's so versatile. Um, really, with the active recoil channel being so low, it just really gets the ball up into the air so easy, and it's it's really really impressive. Really helping reduce spin as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah one hundred percent. And less spin, higher launch, ball's going to go further. Simple. So, guys, that's all the information about the, the new nine one five. Um, it really is a really really impressive golf club. Um, if anyone wants any more information or wants to get a fitting on it, just contact your local pro shop and we will be more than happy to have them.